Okay, 520. Uh, giving thanks always for all things to God the Father in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. So very close. Okay, 520. These words are logically tied to the preceding verse, speaking to one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody in your heart to the Lord, giving thanks always for all things to God the Father in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. As we are making melody in our hearts to the Lord, we are to be giving thanks always. I, I find this easier, actually. I don't know about you. I find it easier to give thanks always than I do to sing spiritual songs and be uplifting, okay? It's very easy for me to say, you know, I, I, I just appreciate the, the things the Lord has done. There's a beautiful flower coming up out of a crack in the sidewalk, and it's just so random. What, what can you do but thank the Lord for that, you know? You see just a, a raccoon. I feed the birds out back in the mall every day. And once in a while, a raccoon will come up and he just stands there and he looks at you. And I'm just like, I'm thankful to the Lord for that because it's just a blessing to have these creatures around you. And so it's very easy to give thanks, I think. Um, it's kind of harder to be uplifting. And sometimes, you know, you're down, you're tired, you're sick, whatever. Um, but even when you're sick, you can give thanks to the Lord for not being sicker, you know? I don't know. So um, somebody emailed me uh, yesterday. I said, I'm just send you a short reply, and then I got to go because I'm going to the doctors, okay? And I didn't explain, which probably wasn't nice of me. I just wanted to get out, and so I said that, and then she came back, and she said um, something about my ear. This ear, I heard it about three months ago, and it, it hurts all the time. And so um, uh, I... Went back to her and said, no, no, it wasn't about my ear. I just went in to have an annual skin cancer check. And I don't have skin cancer, which is good, because that last time it was horrifying getting that thing taken care of. But um, uh, I said, the ear will probably never be better. I think it's damaged permanently. And I said, I'm so glad because when I get to heaven, I'll have something to compare it to. Yeah. This is so much better. So, But, you know, the thing about having a bad ear that really hurts is I get irritable all day long. And, you know, I just am. And I have to. It? What? How'd you hurt it? I, I, it doesn't matter. I don't want to say because it was, I'll tell you in private, okay? But I, I really hurt this ear, and it hurts all the time. Exactly. And so I, I just, uh, yeah. what's that? Yeah, I, I don't want to say it on the, on the, the, the no confessions. You know. Yeah, no, we're, we're streaming live, and I don't want to, you know, anyway. Um, but yeah, if, if you, have something like that. You can find something positive in it. And my positive is that even if it hurts the rest of my life, it won't hurt when I get my new body. So thank you, Jesus. But um, as we are making melody in our hearts to the Lord, we are to be giving thanks always. That's Paul's words there. 